Careful, careful. Oh, you just ripped my shirt. <laughs> nice. We're ready. We're gonna pull it out. I have it greased up. Just change oil, spark plugs, air filter, cleaned out the radiator, new antifreeze, new air filter oil. It's gotta be the oil drain, right? Look at that thing. It's a freaking two inch oil plug. Oh yeah, there it goes. Oh my gosh. That's a lot. <laughs> oh, apparently it's a screen too. Oh, that's kind of cool. Yeah. Okay. Wow. That looks pretty black. Looks like I found a nice spot for the wasp mess. Mmm, yum. Oh. This is for the air filter. I've never seen an air filter like this. Let's see if it leaks. I got new hoses right there. This is an updraft carb, which I don't know anything about. New oil filter, new oil. Yeah, I think we're almost ready to start it up. I wish I had an RPM gauge, I don't. All right, that's what I'm gonna do now. Change out the sickles. Runs good, sounds good. Hydraulics hold, that's pretty cool. There's no hydraulic leaks at all on it, which is very weird because everything with hydraulics leaks. So, especially if it's old. I think I gotta take uh, these off and then I can get to this, this bar and replace these teeth. All right, let's do it. Look how pretty it looked when it was new. I gotta change that belt out, which that's gonna be a pain. Got this off though. There it goes. The only way to get this off is to take this pulley off. Uh, oh, it's coming. Oh, this feels so good. I got it. Yes. Oh, this feels so good. It's off. I can't believe it's off. I don't know you can see, but I think that belt needs to be replaced. All right, we got to say thank you to the sponsor of this video, Bespoke Post. That's right, Bespoke Post is a monthly membership club delivering awesome boxes of top shelf goods from under the radar brands. Every month, they introduce their members cool new products, outdoor gear, home and kitchen goods, this hatchet, clothing, and even more, even live oysters. Based on preference quiz that members fill out when signing up, box lineup changes every month. And each box is around $70 in value, but only you pay a fraction of the price. 90% of the products in Bespoke Post boxes come from small businesses, many of which are based right here in the U.S. The way it works is you only pay of what you want. You get a box assigned to you each month based on a quiz taken when you sign up and before ship, you get a preview of what box comes inside. If you don't like it, you can swap it out for a different box and skip that month entirely for absolutely no charge. You pay for what you want and the box lineup changes every month. Myself, I got the aged, I got the split, and I got the weekender. So to get your 20% off your first box, you're gonna get to click the link in the description Enter my code MARCINKO20 at checkout or go to Bespoke Post slash MARCINKO20. Thank you, Bespoke Post, for sponsoring this video. I'm going to go chop some wood. Holy crap, I got it. <gasps> Ugh. 
It's good. I'm ready to fire this up. New chain, new belts. I still got to adjust some belts in there, but now that the header's up, I got to, I can't get in there. So I'm going to pull it out a little bit, lower the header, adjust those, and we're going to run it down the driveway back and forth and cross our fingers this works. Let's do it. Here we go. I'm excited. You got this. You got this, Wather. Got this, Wather. Come on, baby. There it goes. No. Yep. Doesn't want to turn left. working so it's cutting it and putting it in the middle right yeah yeah i wonder why that side is not cut that much like this side look at that hay there it is there's that cash crop yeah, that's heavy stuff sweet yeah, it's cutting that side's not cutting i don't know why yeah i wonder i think i might need to go this is cutting really nice yeah sweet I gotta get the throttle up a little higher. I think that's what was going on. But it's kind of working. I need to get the GoPros and stuff. Yeah. And uh, we'll see how well this goes. Nice. Here we go. Let's see if we can get it started up again. Call my Uncle Mike. There's a needle valve. Obviously, the float controls a needle valve. And if there's any kind of debris, um, which is probably what happened because it's been sitting for a while, yep. it got lodged in the seat, in the needle seat. Okay. And I jimmy rigged it so it's like somewhat working. I should have just went back. So we're flooding out. So I'm gonna take the carburetor off. Can't go anywhere, I don't have any power. But it is cutting pretty good. Not bad. Um, yeah. So that's a success. We got some leak going on with the clutch, which that's a bummer. I'm just gonna have to add oil, I guess. And uh, yeah. Hopefully we'll get this carb going and then we'll be back in business cutting really slow. Hopefully faster. You just it's just like that engine's not revving up. It's not getting to where it needs. It's not the RPM, so we'll figure it out. 
updraft carb. So what year carb do you think this is? I don't know, man. Yeah. It might be older than me. All right, what's going on with this Ooh, guy? you got some really good looking red gas. Oh yeah, there's some gnarly looking stuff in there, huh? Or in the jet that lets the fuel in, meaning it wasn't able to close all the way. Any kind of Did it all. Oh my gosh. I cannot believe it. We're done with our first cut. We're done with our first cut. Yay. I cannot, like, g the whole time I'm like, something's gonna break. Something's gonna it break. It didn't break today. It didn't break. That's my fancy seat cushion. Nice. Oh, my ass hurts. <laughs> that was a long time. That was like two days. Two days of yeah. cutting. Yeah. <sighs> Good job, babe. So proud of you. Oh, that's so awesome. I'm definitely gonna maintain some stuff and work on it before yeah. next cutting. But, but now you know. Now but it know. did it. Yeah, it actually did it. That's crazy. Crazy to think this 1970 old Oatana, I was able to get it back in shape and actually cut. That's our amazing. First crop. It's amazing. So, we're gonna end this vlog here. Thanks for watching this craziness yeah and uh yeah we'll see you on the next one bye <laughs> bye gonna run, run, gonna run, run, run all the way. my gosh what did i get myself into